roaring down streets of history, jig dancing for loose change, and selling lines from poems for a pittance sake. The idea that, that any of these industries can control our government is insane. We have a flawed democracy. Yo, now once again, my friend, it's the reverend, the first platinum status rap president. My family is the Simmons family. My brother Danny is a poet, is a painter as well, who has the courage to let out what's inside. My other brother, Joseph Simmons, is a rapper. No, it's about that time, boss, to say that we're run, GMC and Jam Master J. Russell, being African American, the things he does is all things hip hop. Leading in the hip hop genre, he was the guy that was able to organize and make sense to corporate America. You got I see the genes. My father was a poet, a teacher at Pace University, and he taught African studies. My father's poetry mostly was about social issues. See my father get on the bus to go to the March on Washington. I was so proud of him. You can't take that out of us. No matter what he's saying about get a job, we get a job. What we heard more was the poetry. Russell said it's the hottest record on the street. Russell, that big dummy, he dropped out of college in his senior year and you relying on his judgment? It wasn't until Russell had well over $10 million that he stopped worrying about Russell's future. <laughs> he was like, OK. Danny, being a great artist, makes a lot of sense to me because my mother was a great artist. So we're all in our own lanes. Russell is deep into politics. Do you think that anything that became the coolest, most mainstream part of American culture later, when it happened, was the reason that kids didn't become shit? The only way to move people toward to give them another chance Give them the education. Give them the opportunity. You go to work every day and you give, but what you get back is a lot less important. I thought of Russell's success with Death Comedy. And I said, let me steal the name. And he allowed me to do that. And we took it to HBO and they bought it as a TV show. People are just being real. And then they turned it into a Broadway show and we won a Tony. We have generations now who actually like poetry because of their poetry and the movement that it started. Please give it up for the future of hip hop, Kanye West. We're still touching people and changing people's view and the way they think and see African Americans. You can do twice as much in half the time now. So I take time every single day to meditate twice and go to yoga. Joey, you know this is a family vacation and not a tour. I'm not going nowhere without my tracksuit. We're just continuously touching people. Here I escape into you and the wailing symbols you have scratched into my walls. Here I wallow and howl into my longest night. Those bells tolling lazy rhythm and blues off into the distance. <laughs>